All right, so this last technique utilizes our thoughts. We can utilize our thoughts to influence our system to go into the rest and digest state. What happens is we can create an unconscious internal dialogue, and sometimes that internal dialogue might run unhealthy programs and say unhealthy things at us, right? And so it might say, often these can be absolutes, like you'll never do this, or you never did this, or you'll always be like this, or you've always been like this, and it'll go into that kind of realm. So this at the root is really all about challenging that voice. It's about taking that moment, taking your inner power, right? Just starting that spark and deciding to just challenge that voice and to begin coming up with counterexamples to show it that it's wrong. And something very fascinating happens because what's happened is that voice has convinced us to delete all of this, right? The rest and digest state when we're feeling good, when we're connected with that, right? So when you begin challenging that voice, interesting things happen when you begin challenging that voice. Basically, you learn to find more and more of this, and you begin to delete more and more of that. Does this make sense? Because as you challenge it, then this storehouse increases, and you have more and more of access points to these memories. And it's easier to access these memories and these references when you're in this state right? So it's all about beginning to challenge that voice. So have fun with it.